Demi Johnson is live at our mobile news tracker. Demi, where are you and what are you seeing out there? Hey, Alexa. So right now we are on 65 North. We're probably just a little bit south of Zionsville. Me and my awesome photojournalist, Andy Garrison, he's driving me around so that we can show you guys what's going on on the road. So let me turn the camera and show you. So right now, you can see the roadways are pretty spotty. So sometimes you're driving, it's pretty clear. Other times you hit some patches of maybe some ice, some snow. The two right lanes are definitely a lot better than the far left lane. We're only going about 45 miles an hour right now. We haven't really slid, but we've definitely hit some slick spots um, of some slush, some ice. And that's kind of what we're dealing with when it comes to snow, too, or the freezing rain. It, it comes down, and then we get a little further, and then there's none. You can see on this bridge that we're going over right now that it was pretty snow-covered. So pretty spotty out there. Now, earlier, we had a conversation with Indy DPW about their plans for the roadways. They were working to get the roads salted well before the rain started to freeze this afternoon. Crews tell us they'll also be out all night and into tomorrow morning's commute. If it's a really light amount of rain, we might be able to get some salt on various um, streets, thoroughfares, roadways across the county. Make sure that you're uh, driving defensively and staying away from other cars, staying especially away from large trucks like Indy Snow Force trucks, um, which are out there uh, with, you know, a, a large amount of material. Again, taking another look at the roads right now. As you, as we head more north, you can kind of see things are a little bit more dicey. And we're just gonna keep taking it slow. We're going about 45 right now. We'll check back in with you guys in about another half hour and let you know where we're at and what we're seeing. Back to you. Demi, thank you very much. You can see from where Demi was showing us, you got to be careful out there. Travel advisories are popping up all over the state. Here's a look at that map right now. Yellow is just an advisory, meaning regular travel can still happen. You see a lot of that on this map. Orange is a watch and only essential travel is recommended. You see we do have some of those areas on our map as well. School closings and delays are running at the bottom of your screen right now. If you don't want to wait, just grab your phone, scan that QR code that just popped up there on the left-hand corner of your screen. It will take you right to the closings page on wishtv.com.